at 12 feet, 3 inches. UConn cornerback Byron Jones set the NFL combine record and the world record in the broad jump back in February in Indy. Oh, and by the way, on top of that, he put up the second best vertical at the combine at 44 and a half inches and had the best 60 yard shuttle coming in at just under 11 seconds. And following the combine, Jones tweeted, quote, thanks for all the love. I swear I had no clue I was going to jump 12 for you. Like, wow, shout out to mom and dad for the good genetics. And then he put a little emoticon, but that's okay. I'll let you. Uh, you going to let him live? Whatever. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Right, nah. He's Welcome, not a man. Fan. <laughs> thank you. Thank Crazy you. athlete with nice style. Thank you. I like, I like, you know, how you put that together there. Thank you very much. Got the same tie, so. Yeah, you were telling us that that's your first suit. My first suit. I bought it at Express. They took care of me, so very happy. Yeah. Many gonna, more to come. I mean, yeah. yeah. <laughs> yeah then when that, the tailor starts showing up at your place, that's when you know you yeah, really, exactly. really made it. Yeah. I'm like, you didn't go to church or nothing? No. Nah, so, you just wore casual clothes to church. Look at they, that. Come as you are. Yes, yeah, come yeah. as you are, as they exactly. say. Um, as Mike mentioned, you opened a lot of people's eyes. Uh, with that historic jump uh, that you had. Um, what were some of the best like text messages and responses that you personally received? Uh, a lot of the vines on Twitter were, were pretty funny. Mm. Um, I, got a, I got a lot of messages from friends and, and family just congratulating me, supporting me and all that stuff. So it was great. Yeah, any, big, any messages from people like you didn't know that of note, I guess? That um, said no, I don't think so. Mm -hmm. No, but you know, we'll see. <laughs> that was crazy, man. I mean, that was, that was something. Can you, can you believe it even now, just seeing that? I mean, I, I wanted to go there, and I wanted to jump well. I knew it was going to jump far, but honestly, 12 feet, anything to 12 feet, I thought was physically and humanly impossible. Had impossible, you done anything so. close to that before? No, I was I was jumping 11.7. That was my highest, so, you know, sometimes I get 11.3, 11.4. So 11.7 11, was my highest, so I was very surprised to hit anywhere, you know, past 12 feet. Okay. Now, obviously, people who had maybe paid attention to some of your college career, they see this, and immediately you almost get the perception of, workout oh, he's one, wonder, he's one of those workout wonder dudes. Yeah. Uh, Underwear Olympics. Uh, under, underwear yeah. Olympics. Yeah. Yeah. How much, if at all, does that perception kind of bother you? Because, you, you know, you had a full college career. Yeah, you know, I played two years at safety and two years at corner. I have some good versatility, and I've been starting for four years as well. So, you know, I've played a lot of football, and I'm a good football player, you know, regardless of what I do, you know, in, in the underwear Olympics. So <laughs> it, it bothers me a little bit, but, you know, for me, I'm not focused on that. I'm focused on what the scouts and coaches, GMs are saying about me, and it's all good things. Okay. Uh, now, Mike here, he thinks of himself as an athlete. <laughs> Well, I sometimes. I, I don't make any kind of... Okay. okay. Yeah. So <laughs> he's tried to do some athletic type things on this show. So we're going to show you a few, and then you can judge for yourself. Oh, man. The type of <laughs> athlete that Mike is. This is him in the vertical. He tried to Ooh. do something. Uh, uh, you still point. jumping, and he already come down. That, that's <laughs> he hilarious. Like, he's celebrating. Like, look at this, Mike. But, but okay. I, I mean, I, got, I clearly have more to get off the ground. <laughs> so I mean, you got a wall right behind you. That's stopping you from getting down where you need to go. Don't try to give him a life. I mean, I'm in jeans. No wall <laughs> oh, sure. I feel you. He's just coming down, and you've already <laughs> completed the jump. And then, uh, y'all just editing this. Here's our favorite. Ooh, nice. So, he yeah, raised Chris Johnson. All right, first of all, see, y'all keep bringing up old stuff. <laughs> he was playing. I was just, playing. You certainly I, I, claimed that victory. No, because no, I didn't think he was going to catch me, but he took it seriously, so I'm just yeah, trying to get across the coming. line. He's coming. He's right? coming. Was what a 20 yard head start? Uh, thereabouts. Well, yeah. It was more than that, wasn't it? No, it was actually 20. Okay. On the dock. <laughs> but I'm thinking, okay, there's no way he's going to suck me up from yeah. 20 yards away. Look but at when he it, almost look did at his form. Well, look, it, the form looks, oh, it looks okay. It looks really? Good. Look, the arms are a little exaggerated. But <laughs> other than that, you look pretty good. No, so, I'm a talking head, man. I look, I look, I have my first time running in forever. And push then he uh, decided to do some uh, push-ups. I forgot why, to prove how many he could do, but... He almost passed out after, like... I could barely feel my arms. There's so many. <laughs> yeah. It was... Good, it good was yeah, he just... my guns. Yeah, look at him on the floor. <laughs> wow, you bring it back memories. Y'all took it back to numbers never lie. <laughs> yeah, exactly. So you... Look at that. Perfect push-ups. Uh, uh -huh. Looks good. I'm not sure how many clap, did, though. Clapping. <laughs> like Rocky. Mike, you can't do that. Why do you want me? Why, this man, first time at ESPN, you all of a sudden want to have him try to climb in. Right? Because that's, his feet wet. Yeah, that's, that's kind of the beauty of it. We figured, you know, one good. athlete to another, yeah. the chocolate. I'm glad you recognize, game recognized game. <laughs> I look real familiar, huh? <laughs> Thank you. He's like, not uh, at all. Let's talk about the real athlete, though. Both, both Todd McShay and Mel Kiper Jr., they have you going in the first round in their latest mock drafts. At this point, given what you accomplished at the combine and the versatility that you alluded to earlier, would you be disappointed if you didn't go on the first day? Oh, no, not at all. Okay. Um, you know, my senior year, I only played seven games. I had a season and an injury. So, you know, to go anywhere from, you know, first to second or even to third with only playing seven games my senior year is a yeah. great accomplishment. Mm. So, uh, Now, one of the, I think, Todd, he actually has you going to the Patriots. Now, with you, you know, your, your high school or where you grew up, rather, yeah. is like 10 minutes from here yeah. uh, from the Bristol campus and having played at UConn. Yeah. Like, cool. what kind of, you know, 
how big would that be for you? That would be great. It would be great. It would kind of be like the same thing going to UConn because I just wanted, I wanted a chance for my friends and family to come to my games. And uh, going, going to the Patriots, they'll have that opportunity as well. So. The, Connecticut's weird because it's like Giants, Patriots. Oh, yeah, it's a split. mix. Who'd you, mix. who'd you root for growing up? Either one my dad was a Giants fan, so okay. I follow my dad, Giants fan. So it doesn't matter. He's obviously going to be a fan of whatever team I get picked to. Yeah. Yeah. Sorry. Uh, one of 28 guys that we're told uh, that are going to Chicago, uh, that does not include Jameis Winston and Marcus Mariota. Um, what, should, what goes into that decision for you to go to Chicago and attend the draft, despite not knowing how early or late your name might be called? Yeah, I guess it's just understanding that there's a possibility you may fall in the draft. You know, just the nature of the draft and understanding what happens on that day. It gets pretty crazy. So you could be projected first round. You may go late second. That's just a part of the business. Um, another thing, you know, is you got your table, and you're only allowed to see a certain amount of people at your table. Mm -hmm. So, if, you know, if my entire family came, you know, I have two two brothers, you know, deployed right now. So if my entire oh, family yeah. came, they wouldn't be able to sit at the table together. So I wouldn't, I probably wouldn't go. Where are your brothers deployed? Uh, one's in Baran, right next to Saudi Arabia. He's a deep sea diver for the Navy. Mm. And uh, the, uh, the Marine, he's in North Africa. Wow, that's awesome. Yeah. Yeah, Great family. Yeah, definitely. Uh, but if you go into the draft, you got a draft, I mean, that's nice. <laughs> yeah. What's your you got your draft suit being made now, right? Oh, yeah, yeah, we got something in the works. We're okay, I'm honest, you got we to keep it a secret, though. We got to keep it a secret. I got so you. are working on it, though. You're like, bam! You got to kill it. <laughs> yeah. Draft suit. Mushroom belt? Care, mushroom, mushroom belt? Mushroom... What is that? I don't know what that means. <laughs> No, because it's we old, though. Oh. We old. You never <laughs> seen you. Boomerang? You never seen Boomerang? Eddie you got to coordinate. No? I don't know. It's not ringing any Rabbit getting old, baby? Wow. 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 Yeah. A piece of mix of he ain't married before my cooking. Um, All right, look. Okay. Next time you come back, yeah. we are giving you boomerang. We to... Oh, my God. Probably, we're old, Mike. <laughs> you probably what? I probably wash it. I just don't remember it based on the... Hey, if I saw you them... You don't remember it. You got to remember that. No, I'm sorry. Are you... you... <laughs> How old are you? I'm 22. <sighs> <laughs> All righty. You watch um, any Murphy movies? I watched a few. Uh, Beverly Hills. Cop. Cop. Yeah, Cop. Yeah, 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 that one. Um, let me think of some other one. I can't. See, I'm not a big movie person, honestly. I don't really sit down and watch too many movies. You're too smart for that, huh? <laughs> no, no, I'm not. <laughs> you know, I just, yourself. I'm outside doing something. Doing something. Yeah, right? I'm, outside. I'm inside franchise yeah. mode, <laughs> memorizing movies. Yeah, that's why you no, broad jumped to 12-3. Yeah, that's Much respect. <laughs> a lot of respect. Thank you for reminding us how old we are. <laughs>